Right, the real deep cool coming at you. Uh, man, I, I was I started a video and all of a sudden it just cut off. I don't know why. Who knows? Anyway, um, I'm always just, just limited to something else now because I was saying some stuff earlier. I was talking about this comment. This uh, actually I had gotten to the point where I was talking about this. I thought I was about to have a conversation with this guy or this brother who had, you know, kind of came out of nowhere, I guess, because I, I didn't know this brother, I don't think. And he was asking me, did I believe? And I was like, uh, even what? You know what I mean? Bada bada bang. He was like, uh, you know, God. And I was like, he said, well, I don't believe in that shit or something like that, I think. Paraphrasing. So I'm like, oh, okay. I said, well, look here, brother. I'm not going to, you know, get into a situation here with you over this I'm just gonna um, let you know that you can call me and we can talk about this but I'm not gonna do this over texting why why are they blocking up the street here I can't I'm trying to get to work I have to go to work all right this is video that I'm, I'm I can use this at the job I guess that I'm gonna be late because somebody's Cops are blocking the street. Just basically blocking the street. I can't be, I can't get to work. What is this? What's going on, dog? I can't get to work. Oh now just forget the video now. Cause now I can't I can't. They blocking the street. Now I'm gonna run late. I don't know what they're doing, man. I'm having no idea what they're doing, but they're making me late. This is crazy. They just standing there, man, flip flapping around. I tell you, man, if they ain't beating on black people, man, they sitting up here blocking the streets for no reason at all. It's idly. Black, look at they ain't even doing nothing. They're standing there. Are you serious? That's, man, I tell you. <laughs> but anyway, Sean and police is define us, I guess. So look here. So my thing is, I, not my, you know, I'm tired of using cliches. My thought is, look, this guy be a guy. No doubt about it. I think I talked about this before. And we'll leave it right there. Now, whether you, because I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to say I'm non-denominational. I believe, but I know there's a guy. Now, don't worry about who I, who I ain't gonna say under that or whatever, but just, just know that that's what I know. So, when I wake up in the middle of the night, you know, I just thank God that I'm, I'm breathing to go take a pee. I, you know, that's what I do. It's just automatic for me. I'm just constantly thinking. You know, I'm thinking, you know, in my, you know, luxurious apartment with my luxurious stuff and my luxurious collection and my luxurious this and that, that, you know, we still safe. That somebody just didn't come out of nowhere and try to you know, try to create havoc or, you know, it didn't catch fire or, you know, whatever. I was just glad, you know, no one's got hurt. All that stuff. But, uh, you know, other people plagiarize God and, 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 and you know, they up and walking and smelling. I said, well, can you smell? Can you sniff? Can you talk? Can you hear? Can you see? You know, because I asked you, all right. All right. Now, I know people have other problems, you know, but what, what gets me is, what gets to me is some people who have problems, I'm not even going to classify, I'm not going to do classifications either, because people start hating me for that. If it ain't for one thing or another, people want to start hating on Raj for what he says out of his big mouth. So, I'm like, well, you know, it's probably a faith thing, okay? So whatever it is, you know, all the blessed people I see every morning, mostly women, on Facebook with their, with their posts and they're blessed and highly favored but you know you ask them how they doing ah, well you know you just said you was blessed and highly favored and the, 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 the greatest uh, the, the, is taking care of you and a man upstairs and all these crazy cliches you know giving God a bad name but you know you're trying to bring God down to you and you're not it's not, it's not going to happen but that's something you deal with you know what I mean all the oh my gods I got to hear when I'm talking to someone or hearing people talk, I gotta hear, oh my God, and like, I'll say in a sentence, I gotta hear it at least three times. Oh my God, I can't believe that you, oh my God, did that, oh my God. You know, just, 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 just blatantly, just, just, you know, 
And I put this out there. I put this out there. But people ain't gonna listen because see, you already programmed to do that. that that's in you. That's that's in your soul. That's in your spirit. You better get rid of that. Because you know you just can't be walking around and saying, "Oh my God," to everything you know. And now nah, people use Jesus as a cuss word. You know, so uh, be careful what you say out your mouth. So I'm here to kind of. God doesn't need defending, but my part, how I feel about my creator, my Lord God, is that I'm just going to plagiarize his name. I'm not going to blame God for natural disasters. You, you see what I'm saying? That, that's the world. All that stuff is the world. Oh, my God. And using Jesus as a cuss word, just blurting it out your mouth for no reason at all. That's in the middle of a sentence. Child, you crazy. Jesus. See all that All that is just programming That you've been programmed to do It is not really a good thing You should be doing So You know you must respect You know people say You fear God See fear God is respect of God You don't need to fear God You know what people You know people die Why did God take him Oh no God, God took him Alright so He out there in the middle of a gun battle He's shooting at somebody They shooting back at him He gets shot here comes the Why did God take him? Uh, no, he was in a gunfight. Okay. Or something else. You know, somebody might be doing what I'm doing, which I shouldn't be doing, but I'm just doing it because I mean, I, I got my hand on the wheel. I'm driving. That's what I do. You know, you mess around getting an accident because you're out here texting while you're driving, whatever, and you hit somebody. Oh my God. And then the person, you know, gets hurt. I ain't gonna say die. Person gets hurt. Oh, you know, and then one thing, then the person dies, like, oh my God. And then the parents like, why did God take him? And then the God, and all the God, why? Yo, y'all need to relax. Okay? You know what I mean? A natural disaster is not, what they call that? Uh, uh, what do they call that? What do they call a natural disaster? Uh, oh, an act of God. What about that? Anything that happens, if this tree falls on me right now, that's an act of God. If, 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 if there's a big giant thunderstorm or something like that or a hurricane and a lot of people get killed, it's an act of God. Hey, y'all, man, y'all be tripping, man. I don't even get down like this. I don't even talk about God because, like I said, my faith is totally personal to me. If you want to ask me about my, don't ask me in front of people. Don't ask me and blast me on my page trying to put me out there. Just call me, text me, inbox me. If you want to know where I stand in my faith, we can talk about it. You know what I mean? You know, I ain't got no problem with that. But there's so many people out here fronting, fronting the game, playing the game fronting, that you know it's just ridiculous. I mean, I just never heard so many church for just, 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 just blurt out, oh my God, all day long. And their parents ain't told them no better than to say, you just can't be walking around saying, oh my God, all day. Just to be saying it. You know, and this God is good thing. I was at my man's funeral yesterday, Mr. Matt Pugh. And uh, this brother was singing. And his, his, his outro was, God is good. God is good. God is good. You know, and then, you know, because the pastor or the preacher, whoever was there, the, the speaker, was mentioning how good God was. And the word good comes from God, for people who didn't know that, if you didn't know. So when people call themselves good, well, I'm a good person. I'm a good, you know, you can't be because you're not God, okay? Good is for God, yes, even in context of singing. But see, God is great. You see what I'm saying? Even Muslims realize that when they say Allah Akbar, God is great. To diminish God to just being good. In other words, God is being good to you. Knowing that he's omnipotent, just ever so everything to you, especially those who go to church every Sunday, that the best you can build out your mouth. I don't even go to church every Sunday and know God is great. I ain't mean, had that wouldn't even came out of my mouth, God is good. There's just no way in the world I'm gonna have a conversation with you and not say, if we got to a particular situation that I'm I'm coming at you like that, I would never say, well, you know, God is good to me. Never. I mean, God is great. God is God is awesome to me. That's the, uh, gr good. I can't I can't do nothing with good. I can't do no more good. Thank you, brother. Trying to make it work on time, brother. Trying to make it work on time. I'm already half late. Thank you. Sitting out here doing nothing. They ain't got no jobs blocking up the street. I'm already half the day after late, but I don't care. I got that video about the 
house block up the street. So, anyway, and this bus, my own set the bus people keep me from getting to work on time. What's up, these folks? I keep this video though, just in case. So, anyway, I just, I just want to pass that to y'all. I went over my 10 minutes and then now I got to upload this, uh, I guess, via YouTube. Didn't give it back to you, only because of that situation. All right? Just, just, just think about what I said. Oh, since I'm overextending this this thing now, and then I got to put it on YouTube. I'll just put this as Rod's thoughts for the day or something like that. <sighs> the penis is the bane of existence. Penis can be blamed, blamed for a lot of things. Penis can be blamed for single parents' households. The penis can be blamed for sexual abuse, child abuse, child pornography. Um the penis can be blamed for Porsches, Audis, BMWs, bad credit. If you want to blame something on somebody and give it a bad name, give Dick a bad name. So, you know, you got to cover it up. I mean, you got to cover up coochie too, but you can't just see a coochie. But you do have to cover up a ding a -ling. So, I'm saying that... I, people say you're crazy. Yeah, I know I'm crazy. It's whatever it is. If you can't let y'all see what I'm doing here. If to procreate or to have sex, it had to be your finger, your index finger. And I guess the woman portal would be a ear. What is it? With people walking around with their finger covered up? I mean, this, seriously. If, 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 because you, you know, that on TV, like dudes, you know, because they don't have big penises, you know, they always show women's, you know, breasts, titty balls. But, you know, they never show a dude's little dingling because it's all shriveled up because they don't handle dinglings. And most of the actors are, you know, so anyway. And we can't show. You know, because then it would be like, oh, all of them are so well endowed and others aren't. So, but let's just get back to this ding -a thing. Because like I said, ding -a is the cause of a lot of things. Okay. I would never want to separate myself from my ding -a I like my ding -a I like the way it feels when it's in action. I like it. I like it when I got to go to the bathroom. Now, but I'm talking about for sex, just for sex. Just, just, just throwing this out there. I ain't got enough to talk about it because I went past the 10 minutes. So I might as well just keep this conversation open. If somehow or other you had to have sex with your finger and I mean, put it in the woman's mouth, so that would be sex. Would you cover up the finger? Would you have to wear a glove? Would the woman have to wear like something over her mouth? I mean, I don't know. Y'all tell me. I'm just throwing it out there. I'm just trying to let you know that having a penis... There's a lot of responsibility. And some people shouldn't have penises because they're not responsible with their penises. Okay? If you're not responsible enough to have one, you shouldn't have it. You know, if you was over in Iran or Iraq or something, you might cut it off. Who knows? You know what they do over there, man. They don't mess around. Muslims do something, steal something, cut off a hand. But uh, I've never seen a man who was involved in adultery get his dingling cut off but they stoned the woman I mean I'm just throwing a lot of stuff out here now, now I'm going all over I'm all over the place right now because that's what I do my pineal gland gets to popping my pineal gland look at, look at, that, look at that sexy card there when the pineal, <laughs> pineal gland gets to popping man I just start talking because see I say things that other people are afraid to say see people are just vague people don't want to talk about anything that's like of substance to make you think you know you hear Michael Bass and the Steve Harvey and all them talk about relationships and they, they, ain't, they ain't got a relationship worth talking about. You know what I mean? But they act like they know experts. All these experts think they know stuff. They don't talk about anything important. You don't talk about how you look at the world in general. You know, because they are paid to tell you what they want you to say. Tell you what they want you to hear. By somebody else. Or they wouldn't be on the air. Ain't no black man had their own radio station or a program and thinking, do you think they're not being told what to tell you in some instances or the other? You know, do you know what programming is? TV programming, radio programming. That's what it's called. I can get into that to you. I 
I, I can do that with you too. I can tell you how CNN is just going off now. They're almost as bad as Fox right now with propaganda, always keeping us in fear. They, that, first it was just Fox trying to keep you in fear. Now it's CNN trying to keep you in fear. What I understand, I heard the CIA, CNN is run by the CIA. It's Ted Turner's piece. But you never know. But they ain't going to talk to you about that. They're going to talk to you about yeah, you're having babies. And I, you know, a good woman is a good woman this. And a queen is a king. That's what I'm going to talk to you about, which is, means nothing. Because when the crap goes down, ain't nobody going to care about none of that. You need to be caring about what I was talking about earlier. That's what you need to be doing. So for the Muslims, Muslims, I guess, I'll say Allah Akbar. And for me, God is always great. I'm glad I can make this video. You figure out what you're supposed to be doing. And stop disrespecting God with your words. And give him his due. Even though he don't need your due. But he's still going to do what he do. I'm out. Roger will be cool. Separate yourself from the rest. Be a leader, not a follower. Stay away from the foolishness. And keep it heavenly. I'm out.